stone form obviously uh, are very good against the panda because assuming it's low ping which I think it is because this is a within Korea game uh, as soon as you see that uh, the panda going for the haze fire you just immediately have to go stone form to um, negate it basically and uh, moon putting up an expansion in this hidden position here and Fav actually doesn't scout it he walks right past it pretty much and so uh, that's gonna work out quite well for him and moon putting up his second ancient of lore sort of far away but I think he's at full yeah he's at f 46 um, food now he has actually a lot of um, gold he should build one more dryad yep there he goes there and uh, this ancient of lore walking back to um moon uh, to his base but I'm not sure it's really necessary uh, this uh, is, was that um, Orb on? Yeah, Orb on the Death Knight. So obviously, Fav in need of a second hero, really. Uh, at, at 39 food compared to Moon's 46. Um, I think uh, uh, Moon must. I'm not sure what happened. Oh, there are the uh, there are the Gargara there. Uh, they just uh, there are two that are upgraded. Obviously, you want to go for attack upgrades on, on um, Gargs just so that your uh, nuking power against Dryads can be really effective, and you can just sort of one hit them and then run away. And uh, Moon's now at thirteen hundred gold. He really should put up some more um, moon wealth, I think, because this expansion is almost good, is almost up, and he really just doesn't want to take a risk at this point. And uh, Moon staffing to the Swiss, and uh, uh, Fall really not trying to stop it. And well, I think that was a bit of um, a bug there. I'm not sure, but I think if you have a wisp on a tree and then you try and staff it, it doesn't work. And I'm surprised Moon doesn't actually didn't actually know that. Um, I'm not sure about that. I think it's I think that's true. If I'm I'll, I'll check that maybe later, maybe if you want to confirm it below. Uh, Moon getting a nice detonate off there, uh, just at the last second. And uh, now putting up an ancient protector somewhere, it said. Uh, I'm not sure where. Um, but uh, now chasing down the uh, death knight, and still level 2, but it is now getting a lich. So this is almost out, and he'll pass that orb immediately, but he will get burnt. Um, yep, there's the burn there. So only level 1 mana burn, so... I'm pretty sure he's gone for evasion. He Still only level 3 demon hunter, level 3 panda as well. Level four panda, very nice, and um, this uh, demon hunter will just get staffed away. There it goes. Obviously, uh, obviously, um, staff on the or er, cooldown on the staff, not too large at all. And uh, these ghouls have just been uh, creeping to uh, try and get the death knight a bit higher experience, but uh, it means that they're now out of position. And Moon loves doing this. Loves just running into a um, undead's base and really doing a lot of damage to their. Uh, that are base and uh, sort of picking off weak units and stuff, and this that just gets around and gets coiled, and but will now die, uh, and I think this is probably it for fall, which is a bit of a shame because um, obviously two of the biggest players that didn't turn out to be um, the greatest series. Obviously, game one was probably better, but uh, there's not really much fall can do at this point. Uh, Moon now putting down two ancient protectors that has been scouted, but uh, his expansion it just finished now, and it'll probably uproot and try and walk over and. Uh, Moon uh, now chasing down all these uh, ghouls, and uh, Fav finally bringing in his gargs, but uh, and they will be able to chase away this army. But or actually no, the panda's still here. Sorry, I didn't see the panda at first. Um, although panda with no mana, so not great. Um, Moon actually has so much gold. N oh no, Moon's now spent his gold. Although on what I'm not sure. He's only at 51 population. Um, but uh, Moon might want to get um, a second orb for his uh, panda, just because orb is so good against uh, these uh, gargs, and you're never sure when they're going to pop up. So, oh, um, Moon now using um, uh, immolation again, just trying to kill off a couple more ghouls, and it looks and that has been successful. He's killed off all those ghouls, I think, and this one ancient protector, which was being harassed by the gargs earlier, now just needs to eat a tree and get away, and. Uh, level 3 on the Death Knight now, L Lich coming back in, uh, has a bit of experience on him, 80 experience now, so that's not bad, but um, not too many Gargs, only 41 population for Fav as opposed to uh, much higher for Moon, whatever it is. Oh, and um, of that 41 population, 7 is tied up in a building um, worm, and 48 for Moon, and he he's really going to be able to um, harass these Acolytes now, they're going to have to run away, and, um, and Moon does have a TP on him. Uh, Fav now coming back in. Uh, as you can see, the haze fire attempt sort of negated by the um, stone form there. Very nice uh, by Fav. And uh, Moon now just running away. He staffs away two units. And really, he just needs to keep on harassing at this point. Uh, he has enough mana for a breath of fire, but not really no point using it because it's not going to kill anything at this point, unless he's actually going to go back in for another attack. He is bringing in 
two more dryads. So he might actually see uh, it might actually be worth using now, um, or he might be waiting waiting for enough mana for the haze. But uh, the frost room is now out, and this is gonna be um, good for Fov and. Moon's gonna want to um get rid of get this uh, demon hunter away, but the demon hunter actually goes down because the um staff is still on cooldown. So very nice there by Fov. I don't think it's actually gonna change anything. He uses breath of fire, but uh obviously less effective now because or uh, the stone form isn't effective now. And um the panda does have a greater invon pot and a us uh, TP, but he's just staffed away by the demon hunter, which has been bought back at the tavern. That's no surprise. Obviously, Moon has a lot of um mana, and actually, Moon being stopped from um rooting by this uh wis uh by the um shade. I'm not sure if that's intentional or not, but I think it's positioned well enough that it can actually um uh, root. So <laughs> that's very clever by Fov there. And this um tree of life is gonna take a lot of damage from these worm from the worm as and um. Moon's going to staff in his Demon Hunter and his Panda, actually. But I think this Tree of Life will actually go down. Very nice play there by Fov. Uh, just constantly stopping the tree from rooting. And uh, Moon getting a good deal of um, kills in, or um, damage done along the way. But still, sort of very good use of uh, his uh, Fov's time. And uh, the Lich separating from the uh, Death Knight. Lich and, uh, and then Death Knight both have taken a lot of damage. But it looks like they probably will get away. There's some Mansion of Wars nearby, but obviously can't. Um, get the kill. And uh, Moon's rebuilding, is that? Yeah, he's rebuilding his Tree of Life now. Um, I'm surprised Moon didn't, uh, or I guess that must have just happened. Uh, Moon does get the uh, Lich kill, and uh, Death Knight just uh, has to run back to his base now. He, can't, he isn't safe at either of the uh, he, he, uh, healing fountains. And uh, these gargoyles, and uh, Frostrum is really low health. I'm surprised he hasn't brought them to the healing fountains actually, just to try and um, heal them up a bit. And they can always escape, uh, not uh, or pretty easily. And a uh, backpack actually for the dryads as well. I'm not sure if there is one instant where um, Moon needed an item because you don't generally go that. Uh, but uh, maybe it was to get that second staff because I think he only has one shop. But this demon hunter taking a lot of damage, but the pandas in, and so we'll just be able to staff out the demon hunter. But uh, the lich comes out, and that could have actually. Um, been a bit of a surprise. Obviously, it couldn't um, mana burn, but it could get the uh, extra damage in. Or sorry, it couldn't um, frost nova, but it could get the extra damage in from the orb. And uh, moon immediately healing him back up his demon hunter and staff back in. Not full health actually, but it looks like that it's gonna be enough to kill the death knight. Although uh, this path has been cleared, and the death knight picks up a um, uh, slippers of agility and manages to get away. Uh, but moon now has killed um, one frost worm and. Oh, Oh no, the other one's just gotten away. Although it's at full health, he should really bring it back. And I'm um, level 5 on the uh, panda now. Uh, actually, 5 and a bit now. So, um, obviously, level 6 is going to be great for him. Um, sta uh, he uses a staff to get away. Uh, actually, just staffs to uh, the wisps here because he suspects that Fob's at this healing counter, which he is. And Moon's probably going to um, manage to kill this uh, Death Knight now. Because he, he does get the haze off and the breath of fire, which is going to slow him down massively. And the um, dryads are here as well. And so this is going to be the end of the um, demon, uh, the end of the death knight, and the end of the game. So um, I hope you enjoyed that. Only two games, but I think that's not a huge surprise because obviously um, moon is moon and fall is out of shape. So um, I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks.